Hi, I'm Sam. And I'm Fred. And we're going to tell you about our journey joining the Caravan and Motorhome Club on the other side. Um, Ooh, yeah, which started off in December, wasn't it? Yeah, we yeah. put our application in late December and lo and behold, heard within a few days. Got a good interview, yeah, interview time. Yep. It was in uh, January, early January. Um, got in there straight after, it was about 10th of January. Mm. Got invited to the induction at Cranage. Yep. Which was really good. Four day induction, um, which was amazing. From the moment we started. Yeah. Um, the As we walked in, yes. the welcome. Yeah. What did we call it? We felt like a, a hug. It was a big hug, a big yeah. warm hug. All yeah. these people there to greet you take you through the process, all at different stages in, in their caravan yep. and motorhome club careers. Um, and and yeah, the four days were absolutely amazing. We had lots of training on various things. Yeah, it covered health and safety, fire, everything. Uh, first, first aid. aid course. Everything like that, which was great, wasn't it? Yeah. It was different. It was a very relaxed course. Yes. But the information given was spot on, like all the other things we attended there. Mm. I thought were really good. They yeah. didn't. It wasn't force-fed. You could see that they were passionate about what they were doing, yeah. and how you, how you yourself from all different backgrounds, could give back to the club and all, all, all its members. It was great. And instantly, you're talking to people who are in the same position as you, all just signed up, all some, some have sold their homes, <laughs> yeah. some have only just bought a motorhome or a yeah. caravan to, to sort of start this journey, and that instantly puts you at ease as well. Yeah. And um, and already we've got lots of phone yeah. numbers and WhatsApp groups going to sort of keep keep in touch with people. But the, um, the training itself at Cranage, I thought it was really good because it was evenly paced through. You had time mm -hmm. to absorb things. Loads of times everyone was coming up to you who was doing it all and saying, if you needed help with this or you're not sure about that, come and mm -hmm. see me, speak to me, here's my number. Yeah. It was great. You didn't yeah. feel left alone at all. No. And from then on, we then came a couple of days later, we started out on site training. Yeah. Um, and that's where we are now, at Ferry Meadows. Which and is... we have had five days on site training with the most outstanding trainers. Um, yeah. Which is really yes. good. Day one was great, wasn't it? Day one was um, all the machinery that is used on site, yep. pre-user checks running you through, and if you needed it done repeated, they would repeat all, all the process Yeah, there again. was no rush, was there, at no all? No rush, really nice and Cause slow. Because everyone learns at different paces, mm. but, and they adapt around that, which is really good. Yeah, so we got to do that for the day, and then at the very end, we got to drive the tractor <laughs> yeah. and go on to uh, the, the live part of the site and uh, do a bin run. Um, yep, which, which was great. Was brilliant and and instantly sort of put me, who I was quite anxious about doing the machinery training, yeah. at ease because I'd already done it the first day, driving the tractor, and uh, yeah, it was really yep. empowering. You enjoyed that bit, didn't you? I did. That was really good because yeah, you were a bit great. sort of apprehensive, but everything got calmed down and you were straight on it and off you went. Yeah, it was really great. Positive. Yeah. On the second day. Um, we were in two groups, so you're in a small group. We got to do um, uh, another bin run, proper training on, on how to do it, um, and all taking part. Um. And we recovered the PU checks as well, we got to yeah. do, which is personal user check, you got to do each time Absolutely. to make sure it's all safe. Um, and then in the afternoon, we got um, more instruction on the machinery and had more of a go. Yeah, on they brought the out all the machinery yeah. for you to look at and, and go through. It was really good. Yeah. Um, and if you were unsure about one bit of kit, you could then go off and with a separate instructor and go through it all. If you're not sure, you know they helped you every single step of the way, which mm -hmm. is which is really good. Another part of the training was the toilet cleaning, uh, which yeah. I'm actually quite looking forward to. Some people love it and some people don't, but it's um, a part, part of the job you get on with. It's yes, oh, we, we were, um, yeah. everyone has said it's, yeah. it's a very positive part of the, the job. Um, it gets uh, yeah. a, bit of, a bit of quiet time or you can put your headphones in and play your music and, and just, just get on and, and give everything And one thing you've got to watch out for when you're doing the toilet block is clean, clean your boots. boots. Make sure they're all clean. <laughs> because as you're scrubbing away and doing things you look behind you like, oh no.
Give me my dog, my dog. This is a way to my dog. So you soon learn quick. <laughs> yeah. So so we we did we had a run through yeah. on that. Uh, later on in the week, we actually yeah. went onto the live site and actually and actually did yeah. a, a proper clean uh, with the timings. So you know, yep. shutting it at the correct time, making sure it was open, yeah. making sure you haven't yep. left anything lying around and cloths and, and bits and pieces. Yeah. And, um, the, and the timing site comes in pretty handy for when we've done our training and we go onto site. You know, you can get it down and get it done within that time. Yeah. Because it has to be open and shut. At, at, each site all, all different times. Mm. Also in between that we had um, things like Legionella yeah. testing, um, <laughs> which, yeah. um, you know, showing us yeah, how, which is a great how, insight, isn't yeah, it? <laughs> how to test the water and, and perhaps not 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 flood yeah. uh, part, part yeah. of the training rooms like we did. Um, yeah. And but but that was really helpful. It's a good a good thing to go through because it's opened your mind to the safety that they actually put in. To, to membership on the site and yourself, yeah, which is really good. Definitely, definitely. You know? um, we we got to walk around the site and do look at the bollards. Okay, so this is another type of bollard that we have on our sites. A very popular bollard. Most members will recognise this bollard as the one that they've used on most of their trips to our site. It's a bollard where you plug in the cable and you have to do a, a quarter turn. It catches most of, a lot of our members out when they plug in the electric and then come over to us and say there's no electric. So we have to plug the cable in, the tester in, and that gives us the test that we, we've got positive power. The three lights are green, so I know 240 volt is working. Um, because you get a list of things that you have to check yeah. week, daily, weekly, monthly, um, and and so it's showing you how to go through the process and every why time. And, and why, why things are set out a certain way. Because coming from a member to doing this, you're not really sure, and now you actually understand it all. You think, ah, oh, that makes sense now. Because mm. when you come onto some sites, you think, well, why is that over there like that, and why is it like this? And now you know. Mm -hmm. Most of it is all for safety. Yeah, and every time you walk around the site, you, each time you're starting to look for things and, and checking the cables on people's motorhomes or caravans and are they correctly yeah. done and, and anything yeah. that might be of danger. So um, we go on day three, because what made me laugh on day three was when you actually went on the grass cutter for the first time, that big kabooza machine. Yeah. How did you find that? So many levers <laughs> and buttons and doing things in the correct order. I think the whole group had a laugh then, <laughs> which is yes. really good. Yeah. <laughs> Quite, quite um, nerve-wracking to start with, uh, the noises it makes and, and things, but, but once you've sort of done it a couple of times and you've, you've gone yeah, up and down. But um, the instructor, Mark, I think it was, was it Mark Phillips? Yeah, Mark Phillips, yeah. come in, great. Just yeah. smoothed everything over, got you going, got you calm, boom, off you went. No looking back, was there? Because I think it was fantastic. Yes, you know? he, he was incredibly good yeah. with me when it came to reversing a trailer. Um, yeah. I've never reversed anything, no. um, and and uh, I did warn him, and uh, he he was just so yep. calm, and get, the instruction was so precise and spot on that on second attempt I parked the trailer. No exactly problem. Where it was supposed it was really to be. good, yeah, yeah, it was great, wasn't really it? good. Which was good to you because you've never done nothing like that before. No. And it gives you that insight into how things work and and what you can actually do yourself. Yeah. Yeah. You know? There was also Martin and Fiona Griffiths doing the training as well, who were incredible, um, gave us so much information, um, their experiences of running sites, their experiences of when yep. they started. Information yep. given over is Absolutely. spot on. Um, we, running us through the travel link process and showing us the computers yeah, we we thought, in the office. Yeah, we thought we were going to come for just machinery, but we cover mm. quite a lot. We do the computer side, the office side, general clean stops work, yep. all, all the procedures, safe procedures, fire training, everything. It all comes together 
yeah. know, one, one little bit was great. And then yeah. we have um, things like that was really good. We go around all the playground stuff, things like that was really good. And we, we're checking for things all the time. Yeah. Which is good, picking out forts if there's anything there. But when we went onto site as a member, we didn't actually see that. No. But now it's, you see anything. it's in you. You actually tend to walk around now. After one week, you're just picking so much up, mm. which is unbelievable. We had a nice fun bit to finish, which yeah. was where we went round and looked at the fire safety on, yeah. on the site and actually went through, right, one of you's in the office, someone runs in, says there's yeah. a fire, you can't reach people on the radios, what would you do? Yes, no, that was funny. And, yeah. Um, yeah, just working in a group and working yeah. out what you would do was, was really insightful. Yeah. And, um, and the walk around on, on some of the training, Pat was good. We've done the le Legionellas, the cyclings, and yeah. what you pick up with, things like that. So thanks to you guys, we feel ready to get onto our site and we can't wait. No, we can't wait. And I'm really excited. Yeah, and thank, thanks to Fairy Meadows for letting us come here and mm. play with all their machinery. It was excellent. Can't recommend it enough. Yeah, let's do it. My name's Lisa. Hello, my name's Matt. We are first years at ASMs uh, for the Caravan and Motorhome Club. Uh, we are based at Ferry Meadows and we have been to Linkfield to do our training. Matt, what did we think of training? The training was absolutely superb. Uh, all the trainers were uh, fantastic and uh, the hotel staff were absolutely fantastic and the food was great. And the food was lovely, Super. very full, yes. Everybody has been absolutely amazing. They've learnt us everything. Everything's well explained. You get all your PPE, don't have to pay for a thing. Great stuff. We know all the safety inside out. <laughs> we know first aid inside out, so you'll be safe with us, you're fine. And we are now based at Ferry Meadows and we did us first day yesterday. Obviously, all the trainings made us feel a lot more uh, relaxed. Uh, we uh, the uh, site uh, managers uh, give us a good uh, insight of the of the site. Uh, we've uh, been cleaning the uh, toilets. Uh, we've been um, booking <laughs> uh, new arrivals in. So we've uh, we've really enjoyed this first day. Uh, there's a lot to do on site, and we're uh, we're looking forward to getting stuck in. For the machinery training, we actually came to Ferry Meadows as well, which was brilliant because we are going to be based here. So that was really good, and the training for the machinery absolutely amazing Martin and Fiona and the rest of the gang you can't we just can't explain how much at ease they put you and explain everything we didn't know anything about machinery nothing and now we're quite confident that we can get on machinery and go and cut the grass have fun everybody hopefully see you all soon thank you